Hey guys, this is Laird Plays, and we are going to be doing some more uh, Dead by Daylight gameplay. We're going to be playing some Blight, and we're going to go. Um, same build as the last one. Um, offering, just going to throw in a yellow blood point. I will switch up the add-ons, though. I'm going to switch to the... After the loading screen. Okay, we're going to switch over to the... This and I don't see a green cooldown, so we're gonna throw out a pile of amount of yellow cooldowns pretty much. So we're gonna switch to the brown cooldown. Uh, recovery speed after rush is the uh, cooldown you go through after that rush where he sticks the syringe in and pulls it out. Oh, let's look at them two console, two not console. Uh, no one's in prestige. I'm not gonna bother going through Steam profiles for this. I still need some good devout emblems. We'll work on that. Uh, base cosmetics. Pretty much the thing, as long as it's not, um, what's it called? Hawkins. The Blight can do okay. I think Hawkins would just be a nightmare for him, because there's so many little things to bump into that aren't, like, strategically placed. They're just in the way. Uh, if you're watching this on YouTube and you want to catch my streams, uh, I'm going to try to be streaming more. Um, Central Standard Time, probably starting 11 p.m. to midnight. Uh, same, nope, Shelter Woods. We were on the uh, Ironworks last time. We're not Ironworks, though. Suffocation Pit. But yeah, um, I will be throwing a link to my Twitch stream in the description of this video, the last video, and, the ne and all the uh, Dead by Daylight gameplays will have links to my Twitch. So the Nia went for a pretty immediate spin. And then her scratch marks just disappear. Okay. I will happily take a free power. And then... Retreat. Retreat. Okay. He vaulted. Another pellet. I know this is a fairly long chase. There it goes. Okay, that wasn't Tinker. Let's go for this hook way out here in the middle of nowhere. This tinker, and I don't think I get to make it to that gen. Let's try. I'm genuinely confused what happened there. have a direction. Okay, 
they got the rescue. Okay, so he used like interacting with the generator almost as a teleport. Because he saw he clicked it and it kind of bounced him around the, gen the uh, generator. That was weird. That's something I hadn't seen before. Right in the shack, see if I can get shack pallet. Most unfortunate. Dude, they are everywhere. I don't understand the pallet camping mentality, because you can get a lot more distance by not camping that pallet. Like, see, there he drops it, and, or he doesn't drop it, he just keeps running. I'll say all the, um... It's about to pop. Okay. Oh, that was a little odd. So they found my ruin, so that's my undying. Oh, she has a flashlight now. Dude, that totem right there is actually a really good information tool. So if anything, that's a good reason to defend it. The fact my, it's my undying just makes it better. I'll put it right on put it right on this generator. That's gonna pause their ability to work on it. Efficiently, because there's now a hooked survivor strapped to it. Good shot. I know it's unlikely. Dude, they've got me so spaced out here. Healed. They're going for the rescue. <laughs> that was so close. Okay, I'm gonna veer off to. Okay, they immediately went and got my undying. Kind of stinks because now that means I only have one ruin left. Okay, um. okay. Just gotta throw her in the basement real quick.
she goes in, it's just gonna be a trade. Okay. She's now dead on hook. That should be just enough time for his borrowed time to be off. The arena did not stay to take a hit for him. Apparently a ninja did that. Oh, he got up right next to me, that's awkward. Oh, that, that was unnecessarily rude. I don't remember already exactly where I dropped him. There he is. And he is right behind me. And he is going to vault the pallet. She's this way. I legit cannot see her. Okay, she's out in front, going this way. See, and that's why Cruel Limits is actually a decent perk. Because if I didn't have it, I wouldn't have gotten this down. And this is my second kill. Better to be on that door. Always get the hit on his way out. gonna run to the other exit and get out and there's not much I can do about that. The scratch marks say they're going this way though. Now let's get some points. Let's look for some uh look for the hatch. It's 
probably its center tree. It's close to a main structure this map has. I got two. The other two were both hooked. Not a bad game. Uh, for the YouTube guys, that's it for this video. Like, comment, subscribe. Uh, see you on the next one, and tell me what y'all think I can do better.